So today's video is going to be comparing a 35% tint on this red 2012 Mustang and 20% tint on the 2015 Mustang. Now, I did 35% tint on this one because this is my first car that I got tint on. And technically it's illegal anything under 35 in Illinois, so I wanted to stick with that. Uh, I will agree 20% looks a lot better, of course, but I wasn't willing to take that chance at the time. I was only 16, like I said. Uh, if we walk by the car, you can see it's pretty, you can tell everything pretty well inside the car. You can see pretty well inside all this, everything that's inside or on the side and then through the back. But when we go to the 2015 with 20% tint on, it's definitely a lot darker. Hopefully it shows up pretty well in the video. Uh, quarter, quarter windows are pretty much, looks like you can't even see anything in them. And then the rear is pretty dark. So inside of 2012, it's not that big of a difference when you drive around. When you first get tint for the first time, it does feel weird because your windshield is not tinted and everything else is a little bit darker. But you get used to it within a couple days. So we can use this line as a reference, as the A-pillar, to see what it looks like. Uh, what it looks like not tinted and tinted. It's not a big difference. It will help keep the heat down a little bit and sun out of your eyes if you had the windows up. But most of the time, I have the windows down. So we'll use that as a comparison. Um, talking about at night... This 35% uh, tint is not a problem. Uh, you can see perfectly fine out your windows, out the sides and the rear without difficulty. And you can ride with the windows up at night. It's not really a problem. Unlike 5% tint where it's almost, well, it is impossible to see out at night. I would not recommend that. So now we'll walk over to the 2015. So we're gonna get inside the 2015 here and we'll show a little comparison. Right away when you get in, I can tell it already feels quite a bit, a little bit darker in here. But um, we'll see the a through the A-pillar again, not tinted, tinted. And talking about uh, nighttime driving and stuff like that, if you're on a not like a street with no street lights or anything at night, it can be a little bit difficult if you're gonna make a turn or something to see out your side windows. It's not big that big of a problem, especially with the headlights on the new Mustangs are a lot brighter than the 2012s. Um, seeing out the rear when reversing as long as you have a bright reverse light so my recommendation would be definitely uh, go with the 20% tint the differs tint laws differ by uh, state but here 20% is illegal but it's worth it and I haven't had any problems with it and uh, had it on for a month now I don't expect to have any problems I'll make a video of nighttime driving also so you can see the difference then so thanks for watching I hope you enjoyed